Ajamu Kojo's Black Wall Street, A Case for Reparations, celebrates black excellence by reimagining the lives of professionals in the Greenwood District of Oklahoma before the 1921 Tulsa Race Massacre. The community was dubbed Black Wall Street for its thriving culture and wealth in spite of strong segregation laws. Kojo's series of large-scale paintings are an homage to black Americans whose stories are concealed in the wake of violence. Kojo's investigation into Black Wall Street began in 2016 after watching a video of Dr. Olivia Hooker, a surviving resident of the Greenwood community at that time. After extensive research, he was inspired to immortalize the people of Greenwood through portraiture. Kojo recruited members of his Brooklyn community, artists, lawyers, and entrepreneurs, to sit for him and enliven his reimagining. He painted his community members in the spirit of Black Wall Street residents as a way of connecting 1920s Tulsa to present-day Brooklyn. Each portrait is framed by drips of black paint referencing the bloodshed in a city built on the oil industry. Kojo's theater and film set experience is evident in how he staged sitters for his portraits, blending wardrobe stylings of the era and the contemporary models for his work. The portraits present a spiritually uplifting dedication to the people who were respectable artists, lawyers, and entrepreneurs in their own day. In doing so, Kojo asks the viewer to reflect on our past and look toward one possible future. Black Wall Street, a case for reparations, is a reminder of the work still to be done. Ajamu Kojo is a figurative painter and filmmaker based in Brooklyn. As a scenic artist, his projects include Law and Order, Boardwalk Empire, Vinyl, Bull, and more. Alongside working on television and film productions, Kojo also develops independent film projects and fine artwork. His artwork is a critical analysis of social, political, and cultural issues through a slice of life, voyeurism, and storytelling. Kojo is a native of Little Rock, Arkansas. He majored in film and television production and minored in theater arts at Howard University. This is his first solo museum exhibition. Curated by Megan C. Austin, Director, Montclair State University Galleries.